This is part two of upper extremity innervation. Here we will learn a few notable muscles that the radial, median, and ulnar nerves innervate. Begin with the radial nerve. Indicate that generally it innervates the upper extremity extensors. Show that it innervates the triceps muscle, C6 to C8, which provides elbow extension, extensor carpi radialis, C6 to C7, which extends the wrist with lateral deviation, and extensor digitorum communis, C7 to C8, which extends the third and fourth digits. Next, show that the median nerve typically innervates muscles within the lateral upper extremity that provide flexor movements. Indicate that its innervation is to muscles distal to the elbow. Show that the median nerve innervates flexor carpi radialis, C6 to C7, which provides wrist flexion with lateral deviation, and abductor pollicis brevis, C8 to T1, which flexes the thumb perpendicular to the plane of the palm. With the palm up, it raises the thumb towards the ceiling. Next, show that generally the ulnar nerve innervates muscles within the medial upper extremity that provide flexor movements. Indicate that like the median nerve, the ulnar nerve's innervation is to muscles distal to the elbow. Show that the ulnar nerve innervates flexor carpi ulnaris, C8 to T1, which flexes the wrist with medial deviation, and flexor digiti minimi, C8 to T1, which flexes the fifth digit toward the palm. This concludes our diagram.